Hello again, so this will be the Prussia Riprap build part 7, uh, assembling the x-axis, and you might be wondering why it's already assembled. Well, when I was recording how to build this on my 4 gigabyte SD card, the corner, or it was broken I guess, and it didn't record anything, so you can kind of see it right here. It broke and I can't get it to work anymore, so it's a piece of junk. So now I'm on a 1 gig SD card. So anyways, so uh, this takes a uh, eight number six nuts and number six uh, screws, and I'm using a uh, half inch half inch screws, so they're not poking out as much on the bottom of the x-axis plastic. And so here's these eight and these eight. And the hardest part about these is to and the inside here trying to get the little pieces of plastic that are left over from the from the print job so I had to go in there with my X-Acto and try to cut out each one of those little uh, plastic strings to get the nut in here and then screw it in from the top. I also used Loctite on these so that they wouldn't be coming loose well at least on the side. Um, and then putting the brass uh, bushings on here before I tighten this up in the next video. Um, on this side, I put the 2 inch uh, 5 sixteenths rod with a with a nut and then a bushing and then a mud washer, I meant washer here and then another a small washer with M's, or the 608 bearing, another washer, mud washer, and then another nut. And then also Loctite that too so it wouldn't be coming off. Alright, so that's pretty much the explanation of the X-axis. Alright, thank you.